Hey guys, here's a video on the true 15-inch uh, touchscreen consoles, just on how to get into maintenance mode. A lot of the time with these trues, especially if they're older, you want to do a touchscreen calibration before you go into maintenance mode. So to do a touchscreen calibration before you get into maintenance mode, with this uh, control panel down here, what you got to press is the incline up button and the speed down button at the same time. So if you just press and hold those, it's about for three to five seconds. If you hold them, and then just let go and then it comes up with this touchscreen calibration and then just hit all of these uh, crosshairs here try and be pretty accurate with it so you hit them all uh, like that and then it will reset because with these touchscreens especially these days if they're cleaning the, the touchscreens with a certain chemical or something like that the touchscreen doesn't become as responsive, so it's good to do a touchscreen calibration first. Um, so then, when you go into maintenance mode, you know it's going to work for you. So, we've done a touchscreen calibration. To get into the maintenance mode, to change some settings, what you've got to do is press and hold the top left corner here of the screen until this true logo here starts flashing like that, and then let go. And then you want to press and hold this manual workout here until it beeps and then this is maintenance mode and then from in here you can just hit these certain settings and because we've done a touch screen calibration already we know the screen's going to react and respond quickly here's all the parameters in here hit return you do some calibrations but if you do calibration and then hit return it takes you back to the start screen so you have to do the uh, press and hold the top left and press and hold the bottom right again to get in there so if i just show you through some of these other settings uh, diagnostics, this will give you the hours of operation and um, uh, distance, so it's good to know how long the machine's gone for. Error logs, it'll log the last um, four or five errors here that it's had. It's actually five errors, but then the fifth one's empty here. Um, so that'll tell you what has happened in the, in the, in the past. Uh, you can clear the details or go into it. Hit the exit button, go back. Um, there's other settings here you can um, look into as well, which gives you... <coughs> All the, all the different settings in here. Hit the exit, exit again, uh, and then utilities here. He, here's where also you can do a touchscreen calibration. So get that glare on the screen. Touchscreen calibration here uh, as well. So if you do want to go into maintenance mode straight away, you can hit the top left and bottom right, and then you can go through to utilities down the bottom, and then come into here and do a touchscreen calibration. But if the touchscreen is not very responsive when you're pressing and holding and it doesn't work then do a touchscreen calibration from down here first uh, and hit all the crosshairs and then do the uh, top left bottom right and you should be able to get in there uh, with a reset of the touchscreen calibration especially if it's an old older version um, hit exit and then hit exit again make sure you hit the exit and it does go back to the start screen because sometimes if you don't hit the button properly it'll stay within the maintenance mode and then if people come up with the treadmill they might um, change some parameters inside the treadmill thanks for that